This is Partner Lessons, Maths Teacher, Dagenham Park, Shakespeare and School. And today we are looking for the aim of the lesson, expand and simplify. We are looking for today D and C grade work. The part one we are looking for today, for the part one, expand single brackets. When we expand the single brackets, so what we are looking for the expand the single brackets. So, let's say this question here now. 2 bracket x plus 3. When you expand the brackets, what is the meaning of the expand? Expand means open the brackets. When you open the brackets, what will happen here? You have to multiply that 2 times x. So you have to multiply that 2 times x. That means 2 times x is come to 2x. Then you got a plus here. Then again, 2 times 3. So again, you multiply by 2 times 3. So the 2 times 3 is come to 6. That's it. So you have to make sure what I'm talking about, the expand. The expand means open the brackets. When you open the brackets, what we are doing here, we just multiply each one. So that 2 times x is come to 2x, then plus 2 times 3 is come to 6. But we'll talk about the mistakes. And what are the mistakes that people can make it? Let's say, the same question I'm talking about, 2, open bracket, x plus 3. And then, they do that first 2 times x, they put it 2x. But the next one, they put 5 here. Where is the coming from? That's the spot point you have to talk about now. Because what they're thinking, 2, then plus here, they're thinking at 3, so 2 at 3 is come to 5. But it's not really. You have to understand very clearly what the expand means, then you never ever make any mistake like this. So, you have to make sure very, very clearly, expand means each time you just multiply. That's it. Now, we talk about the different questions. When you talk about the different questions, let's say these questions now. The question we got, 2x, then x minus 5. So again we are doing it here. x prime means each time you multiply. 2x, then times x. So 2x times x is come to 2x squared. Then minus. Then 2x times 5. So the 2x times 5 is come to 10x. So 2x times x is 2x squared minus 2x times 5 is come to 10x. So now we're moving on to the something with that sign, some more complicated questions. Same way you have to use it. Expand means each time you multiply. But when I'm talking about this type of question, have a look. We got minus 3y, then y minus 2x, then plus 1. Don't think this is the heart. Same technique you had to use in here. Expand means open the bracket. Open the bracket means each time you have to multiply. But for this case, I just want to introduce to you a little bit spot point on that. So what I'm going to introduce to you guys, you have to make sure when you expand this kind of questions, we focus on the SNL method. S N L method. 
So, what is a standard for? A standard for the sign. What sign are we looking for? L standard for the number. L standard for the letter. So when we expand in brackets, the first we're looking sign, then number, then letter. What are we talking about the sign now? We'll see talking about the sign now. The sign means if you put a minus, and then when you multiply by minus, so the minus times minus. The answers come to plus. I just want to make it easier. When you do the exam, you can also remember that. Minus, this looks like a minus. Is another minus here? When you join it, it's coming to, to like that. It's going to go to the plus. So this quickly to remember minus and minus. If you two minus together, two minus together, it's going to go to plus. So easy to remember that. Because the people make a mistake here. So when you do the exam, used to remember minus minus joint joint is come to plus because plus times plus just easier plus times plus is always plus and then plus times minus is come to minus and also we used to remember that minus into minus is come to plus and then plus times minus because of the different sign difference means take away so the different sign many times it is come to minus now we'll talk about this question so the first one we got minus y means there's no sign means there's a plus here and also y means you should know there's number one here so we'll see the SNL method now we focus on the sign what sign do you got minus what sign here plus so when you multiply when you multiply minus times plus is gives minus first then we done the s now we focus on the n n standard for number so what number we got three what number here one so three times one is come to three the next one we focus on the letter. We got a letter here y. We got a letter here y. Then y times y is come to y squared. See how they are easier. You have to focus on the SNL. Sign number letter. And then you focus on the sign. Minus into minus plus. Plus times plus is plus. And then different sign when you multiply is come to minus. The next one. We got a sign minus here. We got a sign minus here. So we multiply that first. Minus times minus is come to plus. Then 3 times 2 is 6. Y times X. You can say YX. But easier alphabetic order. X come first then Y after. You can put YX. Or you can put XY. But a nice way you could put XY. So that put XY. And then next one, you got minus here, then plus here, minus times plus is come to minus, 3 times 1 is 3, then 1. That's it. So this gives how you can move to this D to C work. And that's about the expand single brackets. So, these are the questions you have to work on now. So, that's the five questions. You can spend each question for one minute, then after we'll check the answer. It's okay? These are the questions you have to try. So, try that now. Now, the each one, we'll check the answers. The first one, expand each time you multiply. 2 times x is 2x, then plus. 
2 times 3 is come to 6. Make sure where you can make a mistake. You can put it to x. Some people can put 2 and 3. That's your dangerous part. You have to make sure. You have to make sure where you can make a mistake. Thank you. The next one. 7 times 2y is come to 14y. Then minus 7 times 1 is come to 7. Then where you can make a mistake. You can put the 14y. But because of the minus, what do you think? The third one. Sign number letter. Sign minus. Here sign plus. Minus times plus is minus. What number we got? To make sure x means 1 here. X means 1 here. So 1 times 1 is 1. You can put the 1 if you want. And then x times x come to x squared. The next one, sign number letter. The sign is minus. And then you have to make sure each time you have to multiply. So minus times minus is come to plus. You have to make sure, very, very careful. Minus and the other minus. When you multiply, when you multiply, it's come to plus. Then 1 times 5 is 5. Then x. The next one, sign first. Minus here plus. Minus times plus is minus. 3 here, 1 here. 3 times 1 is 3 x times x is x squared minus times minus is come to plus 3 times 1 is 3 x times y is xy the next one minus times plus is minus 3 times 1 is 3 then x you can see that sign number letter sign number letter sign number letters sign number letter so we expand sign number letter so the next one two plus here plus so that's plus you don't want the plus in the front the number two times four is eight x times x is x squared the sign plus times minus minus one here two times one is two then x y plus times minus one we are looking for the next one part to expand and simplify focus on the secret work thank you for watching nadesan tv bye now